Okay. I'm going to talk first. Okay. Okay, oh, they can hear me. <laughs> <laughs> no, my friend who's there in the comments said she can hear me. <laughs> okay. Hi, everybody. Thank you for coming to our first concert ever as this group. We are Lua. And Lua started uh, with Shamima Sony and myself. I'm Miriam Toller. Uh, years ago, we were exploring some world music, like music from around the world, to do a children's program. Um, but actually, before I say anything more about this, I just want to first do a land acknowledgement. Um, I want to acknowledge that the land we're meeting on is the traditional territory of many nations, including the Mississaugas of the Credit, the Anishinaabeg the Chippewa, the Haudenosaunee, and the Wendat peoples, and is now home to many diverse First Nations, Inuit and Métis people. We also acknowledge that Toronto is covered by Treaty 13 with the Mississaugas of the Credit. I personally, actually three of us come here as immigrants. Uh, I came from Egypt, Shamima came from South Africa, and Walid came from Sudan, and Ernie was born here. And I am trying to learn more about the real history of this country, not the history I was taught in school, which I'm now finding out was lies, many lies. It's very shameful, actually. <coughs> and we stand with the Indigenous people of Canada, and we call on our government to implement the 94 calls to action. I s I'm sorry, I just get emotional every time. Of the Truth and Reconciliation Commission. So now about our group. <laughs> We're very excited to be presenting this brand new group. Shamima and I began this journey when we were young mothers. My, my, my oldest child is now 20. <laughs> and we, we discovered that a lot of music programming offered to children was very Eurocentric and it had little to offer in terms of reflecting the diverse cultures that we were surrounded by. And so we began a mission to create a different kind of program to feature traditional children's songs that needed exposure. And it was a joy to work on these songs and to add our own touches to them. And it inspi inspired us so much um, that we wanted to put a group together to actually perform them, not just for children, but for children of all ages, from mm -hmm. zero to 100. And um, we wanted to present them alongside our own original works. Um, so we're really excited to share this evening with you. Some of these songs have never been performed before tonight in public outside of like living rooms. <laughs> and so <laughs> I also want to thank the Canada Council for the Arts and the Toronto Arts Council because without that support we couldn't have put this concert together. Uh, and I'll let Shamima introduce our first song. Good evening everyone. The first song is called Ntuha. It's a song from Uganda and it translates to the crested crane. When we perform it for you, you will hear wawali in the song, which is the sound of the crane. Mm -hmm. One, two. One, two, you know what to do. Yaba! Wawali, 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 wawali
clapping or something going on. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're going to go on to the next two songs. I'm going to introduce them. Uh, so the next song we're going to do is called Nakri's Dream. It's one of my original songs. And Nakri's is one of my absolute favorite Arabic scales. Sorry, I'm going to put this drum away over there. Um, and so this song starts in that beautiful, beautiful scale. Whoopsie, not like that. <laughs> and um, the lyrics came to me when I was actually on a flight. This, this song is actually really, really old, but I've never had a group to perform it with. And I was on a flight, I was surrounded by clouds. It's you're, you know when you're in a plane and it's so weird, like you feel like, what a weird thing, I'm in this big piece of metal in the sky, <laughs> just flying it. among the clouds and just wondering about the world and our place as human beings in it. Um, and uh, so that's Nakri's dream. And then we're going to go into um, a song that is a traditional Cambodian song called The Elephant. And uh, for that second song, Shamima and I were both really drawn to the gorgeous, unpredictable melody that evoked, when you hear it, you'll just feel like you can s almost picture the elephant and the slow moving, crossing great distances with uh, whatever people and things that it's carrying. So that's going to be the second song. But we will start with Nakri's Dream. It's going to feature Ernie um, on the beautiful Nay. Thank you. 
clouds floating down and
so much and thank you Nadia and Desina and Kathy for showing some love I can only if you're watching on Facebook I'm sorry I don't see your comments because I only have one device here so I'm I'm on the YouTube but thank you to everybody who's watching whether you're on Facebook or on YouTube so the next song next two songs we're going to do are Hamsa Zor and Don Don Baji Hamsa Zor is a song that I wrote for my husband, Massimo, and my two children, Ilyas and Naima. Hamsa is an Arabic word, which is a symbol for the number five. It is the number five, and it's also a symbol of protection. And Zor is an, in, an Urdu word, meaning strength. And then after that, we're going to do uh, Don Don Baji, which is a traditional Sudanese song. Uh, the version that we found is just a two-line vocal melody chant um, that I used as a bass to make this new arrangement, which we'll present to you tonight. I was really drawn to this piece when I first discovered it, and I 
knew I connected with it immediately and I felt that I had to develop it further and then, you know, have it brought to Mariam and the two of us sing it together. I just want to acknowledge it's very weird doing this with just four cameras here. <laughs> I know that you're all out there, but I want to, I, because I am watching on my phone too, I just want to mention Shami to look in the camera sometimes. <laughs> 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 anyway. Onwards and upwards. I know, I'm just, I'm facing you guys. So I'm <laughs> focused on you guys. Okay.
Just tell a little joke or something while we'll <laughs> change his instruments. No. <laughs> yeah, well, Waleed's on double duty because he's an awesome yes. percussionist and an awesome bass player, so we had to make him do everything <laughs> and sing, of course, as well. And he has many other talents, but we couldn't make him do like 10 million things. <laughs> Only three. Next or time. Four. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Only for you, Miriam. Yeah. <laughs>
So that song, as you heard, featured Ernie Toller on sax. And I have a few messages from the YouTube messages. Eheb says hello to Shamima. Hi, Hi Eheb. <laughs> I haven't seen you in years. <laughs> yes. And, uh, and welcome Lida and Brandis uh, for coming. And uh, please continue to enjoy. We're going to keep going with our set. Um, and I just had an idea, actually, since I, I'm not on the Facebook, if anybody would like to check the Facebook messages and then put them in the YouTube chat, then I can respond. <laughs> but I can't otherwise, because I can only multitask so much. Um, so I'm going to introduce the next song. One second here. Um, the next song we're going to do is a song that I wrote, and it's called Sandstorm. Oh, there it is. Okay. And actually, I didn't write the music for this piece. The melody of this piece uh, is from a gamelan piece called Sorban Palid, which means floating turban. And I learned that song when I was singing with a group here from Toronto called the Evergreen Club Gamelan. And they asked me to come up with original English lyrics to go with it. And so I was with Ernie's sister, Alison, in Egypt. Um, and I was there, and Ernie had flown back to Canada for a gig. So it was just Ev uh, Alison and I and my two older children, but they were quite young at that time. And while we were there, there was an incredibly uh, strong sandstorm that happened, and it felt like it could actually knock the building over that we were in. And we were actually kind of scared, and it really made me miss my loved ones back in Canada, and I was nervous, and I had my two little children, and I was worried about them. And so that's where the lyrics came from. And so I named, I renamed the song Sandstorm. But there's a little reference to floating, to the floating turban. <laughs> so this is Sandstorm. I'm just going to get my drum. Gazing in your eyes across the sand, swirling through the skies all around and around, the winds are so strong. Ride out these storms, then all will be known. The velvet sand speaks to me. I listen with my hands. Can you see me so far away, far away from you? Reach into me.
sing loud, sing strong, sing loud, sing strong, and dance in rhythm with the stars. Following song. desert sands reaching for you from afar I will walk to lock your eyes in mine to be with you in your arms floating together we can run through these storms and dance in rhythm with the stars. Sing loud so you will be found. Sing loud for me to find Sing loud, sing strong, sing loud, sing strong, and dance in rhythm with the stars. Oh, oh, oh. Sing loud, sing strong, sing loud, sing strong, and dance in rhythm with the Thank you. Thanks, boys. Nice. That featured everybody doing little nice solos. So thank you, Shamima, Walid, and Ernie for your contributions. And to Alison Long for writing half of those words. <laughs> All right. The next song, I'm going to introduce the next two songs, actually. Tell them. Yeah. Tell those guys yeah. over there. I'm sorry, I'm like, <laughs> I'm telling you guys. You, I'm going to introduce the songs to you, okay? <laughs> and I'll talk. I'll write, uh, <laughs> Are you good with that? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to do that, yeah. I'll do that. <laughs> okay, um, so the next two songs are Lampedusa and Our Way. Uh, Lampedusa, I wrote both of these songs, and... Lampedusa is the southernmost island in the Sicilian region of Italy. And it's, you know, for a number of years has become one of the primary uh, European entry points for migrants, mainly from Libya in northern uh, Africa. So I wrote this song as an homage to the thousands of people seeking refuge, asylum, safety for themselves and their families. Um, I think they, they desire what we all desire collectively as a human race is the opportunity just to work and feed your family. And um, I wrote Lampedusa in 6-8 time to mimic the feeling of a boat in the water at the mercy of the waves. And 
this will be followed by another one of my compositions called Our Way. And that was written very recently, a few weeks ago, and it was written uh, reflectively. I think like most people, I've been reflecting on where we're at in this world, where we're heading and what's important for all of us. And that's what came to my head.
in the tool command. And look at the tool. Like condom. And look condom. Like condom. I like a soup. Like a cook of the beginning. Like a soup. I like a soup. And look at the kit. And look at the kit. Mm-hmm.
Thank you. And thank, thank you, you, Shamima, for your beautiful compositions. Thank you. Never thank been you. heard before in public. <laughs> Never. You are the lucky audience. You got to hear it first. Um, we're going to, we're coming close to the end. We have two more songs. Um, mm. uh, the next song we're going to do is from Brazil, and it's based on a game that's played to the style of song and dance known as the Hoda, and it's called Ciranda. Oh, and I'll need that shaker, Ernie. <laughs> well, if you want to dance at home, guys, go ahead. Uh, and uh, thank you for the hearts, Daniel Myers. I don't know if you know Daniel. Oh, <laughs> thanks, Daniel yeah. and Kirsten and Freya and Moby. Yeah. So, yes, we're going to do Ciranda for you. Oh, actually, let me take my picks off. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You're being picky. Well, I'm being very picky, boys. <laughs> okay. Africa Unite, and Walid brought this song to us, and um, I actually fell in love with it when I heard it. I, kn I didn't know this song before, but Walid, Shamima, and I were all born in Africa. I was born in Egypt, Walid was born in Sudan, Shamima was born in South Africa, and it's actually a known fact that all humans did originate in Africa. So even Ernie's ancestors at some point were in Africa. <laughs> and so we thought this 
was an amazing <laughs> choice to end the evening. And uh, Walid, I don't know if you want to say anything about it, because I know you changed the words. I yeah. think the song said it all. Yeah. I mean, Bob Marley, you know, as growing in Africa, Bob Marley is like number one, you know, like singer being really loved, like in any, every household. Like, you know, you walk up, you know, you walk on the street in Sudan, and the youth, uh, you know, I was a child at that time, and you hear a lot of a Bob Marley song. You just picked up the song naturally. He's the most uh, loved artist, probably. So in, uh, true. Yeah, yeah. And here we go, right? One and two. One and two, you know what to do. Mama Africa, Mama, Mama Africa, Mama, Mama Africa, Mama, Mama Africa. are going to our father's land how good and how blood and it would be before the colonization to see the unification of all african and it's been said already let it be done we are the children of the we are the children of the motherland. We are the children of the African. We are the children of the motherland. Mama, Mama Africa. Mama, Mama Africa. Mama, Mama Africa, Mama, Mama Africa. Africa unite, cause we moving right out of Babylon, and we're going to our mother's land Africa unite cause we moving right out of Babylon and we're going to our father's land how good and how blood and it would be before the colonization to see the unification of all African art has been saved Already, let it be done. We are the children of the African. We are the children of the motherland. We are the children of the African. We are the children of the Mama, Mama Africa, Mama, Mama Africa, Mama, Mama Africa, Mama, Mama Africa. Well, thank you very much, everybody. We have come to the end of our evening, and um, before I say anything more, first I just want to acknowledge. Hello, Munir Darej. Hello, Munir said hello. <laughs> and Diabolic Kalidan. I don't know if you know who that is, but that's their name on uh, YouTube, is chilling out. So thank you for chilling out with us. Oh, Rodan, Hazel, and Gabe. 
Oh, <laughs> Robina, Hazel, and Gabe. Oh, okay. <laughs> and somebody named David Curry loved that last one. Thank you, David. David Curry and Sharon. Hi, guys. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, everybody on Facebook. I'm really sorry I'm not on Facebook, so I don't know who you are. But uh, thank you to everybody who has come to see our debut concert. Thank you. I'm going to let Shamima introduce the band. So Lua is Ernie Toller on wind instruments and vocals, Walid Abdul Hamid on bass, percussion, and vocals, Mariam on vocals, kanun, and percussion. And of course, Shamima on <laughs> piano, percussion, and vocals. <laughs> and uh, thank you, everyone, for coming. We want to give a huge, huge thank you to Reza Mogaddas. I can yes. totally say a lot, he man. is like the best sound man in Toronto. We yes. are so lucky, so lucky. And I also want to thank Al Nasir. He has been doing all the camera work here. Camera. One guy, four cameras. That's yeah. pretty impressive. So thank oh you, Al Nasir. And also thank you to Shrishti Chuhan and Small World Music for organizing the live streaming platforms because I didn't, couldn't figure it out. So thank you so much for doing that for me. And again, to the Canada Council for the Arts, to the Toronto Arts Council for making this concert even possible. And we just want to say to everyone, um, Thank you for being with us. I know thank that we're you, all spread you. apart and it's hard to be able to gather and we feel you and we hear you and we love you. And even if we don't know you, we love you so much. And we want to just say happy solstice, happy holidays, Merry Christmas, happy Kwanzaa, happy Hanukkah that passed, happy every celebration that everybody is celebrating. And we want to wish you all the very, very best. Thank you for joining us thank tonight. Thank you. I don't know if we're still on. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs>